Birds flying high, you know how I feel. Sun in the sky, you know how I feel. Breeze drifting on by, you know how I feel. It's a new dawn, it's a new day, it's a new life for me. And I'm feeling good. Hello everyone, my name is Titi Owusu and I am a Ghanaian artist. Um, I got into music at a very early age. I started singing as soon as I started talking, basically. And so it was no surprise. This is all I've known. This is what I was born to do. I am an only child, but before my parents had me, they both had a child each. Came together, had me, got separated. My mom remarried. My stepdad has four kids. So it's pretty complicated. I don't know whether to say I'm an only child, the last child, the first child. Yeah. My family has always been supportive of uh, my music career because they've known that this is what I've always wanted to do since I was a child. I've been singing since I was a baby. <laughs> so this was no surprise to them. They always knew this was what I wanted to do. This is the gift that God has given me and they just supported it. So I went to Blessed Assurance, that's primary and junior high school. And senior high school, I went to Ganas, Ghana Senior Secondary School in Koforidia. Um, right after high school, I went straight to Vodafone Icons and then music took off from there. Vodafone Icons was really worth it. Um, I got to have voice training for the first time. I had never in my life had voice training before. It taught me how to, you know, communicate with a crowd when I'm on stage. It just opened my eyes to so many things. It opened me up to so many different talents, you know, so many ways of performing. And it was really the best experience. I wouldn't want to fit myself into a genre because I'm still trying to figure it out. I'm a new artist. I'm doing everything. I'm making all types of music, anything that feels good to me. I've made rap songs. I've made Afrobeat songs. I've made reggae songs. I've made R&B songs. So yeah, anything that feels good to me and sounds good to me right now, I'm making it. Till I figure out that one sound that is made for me, I guess. So um, right after Vodafone Icons, I met Jay So. He was working on a few songs by then. He was actually working on a project, 0106 Volume 1. And he put me in a song called Beauty. That was the first song that I was on that ever got put out. I was so excited. After Beauty, he released um, other 0106 projects. And there were songs like Nice to Know that had um, Shaker and Koja Q on it as well as JSO, there was also Sunshine. And then finally in 2019, I released my first single, which is called Karma featuring It's Tiffany. And then in 2020, I released Pray For Me featuring Mologo. He's from Nigeria. And I've after that, I've been on songs like Until I See You by Brian the Mensa. I've worked with people like Akwabwa. I did backing vocals on one of his songs for his album, Matters of the Heart. Um, I've also been on songs like Better with Mr. Drew. I've been on a couple projects. Yes, some are yet to come out. Did you know that your baby boy has come to make you I think live performances have helped me grow so much. Like there are so, I, I can't even begin to explain how better I've gotten since I started doing this live music thing. My voice has gotten more texture. I've learned so much. Every single time I do a performance that I don't feel right about, I correct it the next time, you know, and it, it's really helped me vocally.
So it is typically um, the duty of the venue to ask for permission, you know, for live performances like these. However, I always credit these artists, whether on stage, whether on my, my, on my Instagram. And I've actually received some cosigns from these artists, so I guess I'm doing a good job. The live music scene in Ghana is pretty lucrative if you work with a lot of event organizers, you know. You need to know people to be able to get all of these, you know, deals or gigs. Ooh, the best venues for live music in Accra. Not to be biased, <laughs> but I'd say The Woods because I, I perform there sometimes. There's The Woods plus 233, Ali Bar and L Lounge. My top five favorite covers to sing would be Feeling Good by Nina Simone, At Last by Etta James, Turn Your Lights Down Low by Bob Marley, the remix featuring Lauren Hale, Natural Woman by Aretha Franklin, and Subway by Asa. Okay, my number one would be Nina Simone. So let's go. Birds flying high, you know how I feel. Sun in the sky, you know how I feel. Breeze drifting on by, you know how I feel. It's a new dawn, it's a new day, it's a new life for me. And I'm feeling good. As a performer in Ghana, I think the biggest challenge that I face is with time. Definitely with time. Because an event organizer could tell me to be at the venue at five. And I would have to wait four hours more before the event starts. It makes me really tired. And I really wish we could change that. We could manage our time properly. I would definitely like to see more women and not just women making music. I mean, women producing, women creative directing, women doing every, I want to see women everywhere. My manager is a woman, by the way. So there's this African saying that's what an elderly person would see sitting down, a child would never see standing on a mountain. That is how important mentorship is, you know? Mentorship is you basically taking advice and training from someone who has already done it, been there, done that, you know? And so it's important for you to learn out of this person's experience. And I think when I met Jay So, that was the situation surrounding it. He has taught me so much, so, so much. I cannot even begin to tell you how much he has taught me, but it's definitely made me a better performer, a better singer, a better recording artist, most of all. And so, yeah, it's very, mentorship is very important. So, for my young artists, well, including myself, <laughs> I'd say follow your heart, put your everything into your art. It's really gonna pay off, trust. Make you no worry about the thing. Just sit back, relax, and let me cater to you. Gave you my all. Promise to be right where you are. Baby, just call. Be rest assured you have my heart. Cause you're so special. Glad I met you. Brighten up my day, lighten up my nights. You're so special. Glad I met you. Brighten up my day, lighten up my nights. Oh, don't you? Yeah. I do it all for love. <laughs> hey guys, this is Titi Owusu, a Ghanaian artist, and you are watching. Face to Face Africa, the premier global black voice.